I love working with cities and municipalities. They want to really understand how can technology and intelligent connectivity help them solve real world problems, like not having enough water, pollution, transportation, traffic, the ability to communicate and manage their overall network. And it all starts with just really understanding kind of the art of the possible, just changing the way that they think about their own departments. You're no longer the lighting department, you're the connectivity department because that light pole needs to do more than just light. What if it had a small cell on it? Solve density issues for a new up and coming area in a city. So now all of a sudden the lighting department's working with the transportation department. The concept of being able to combine a lot of those different franchises into a single unit is really is something if I was to design a city, it would be intelligent enough to basically interact with its citizens and the government at the same time. So to me, an intelligent or smart city isn't so much about the type of technology or the type of connectivity that's being used, but it is about the fact that you've got data and information that's being shared across departments from department to department, as well as back to the citizens and then back again. So it's almost like a ever circling system. And eventually that makes the whole system even more efficient and effective and sustainable too. I think, you know, the, the unique thing about the work that we're doing in the IoT and industrial internet and smart cities, it's the fact that you have intelligent connectivity combining with human behavior. And that's really super transformative to really how we're going to live our lives. You are only limited by your imagination and what you know.